Last Friday in Ponowi village, the Siwi Teme people of the Namelga tribe Yalibupangya district compensated the Ekai tribe from the Mbongo district. They presented 75 pigs, four cows, two cassowaries, and more than 90,000 kina in cash to establish peace after a man was killed. The man from Ekai was run over by a PNV bus belonging to Siwi Teme. Now all the family inside, long family belonging, all in take now, all here to stand up, now all here to work in this compensation. The Law and Order Committee described the compensation payment as the biggest in the area amidst the threat of the African swine fever and restrictions imposed on the movement of pigs, especially in affected provinces including the Southern Highlands. The ASF, a disease that has killed pigs in the Mendi and Nipa districts, was overlooked because it was important that these two tribes made peace immediately. The ASF restrictions has also increased the value of pigs in the province. Ruth Undi, who lives overseas, came home to Ponowi to assist her father's Namelga tribe to compensate her mother's Ekai tribe. I'm here with my tribe uh, to give another tribe uh, all this pig, the value of this pig. And we are talking about pig and money. It brings peace to the community. Uh, thank you, Papua New Guinea. I'm here with my tribe of Simiuteme. The Akai tribe leader and peacemaker Iwanis Tenigi was happy that peace is now restored after they lost a the leader of their community through the car accident. Salome Vincent, TV One News.